Hey everybody, Johan Magnussen here, Big Sweet Barbecue, and today we're making a kangaroo chili on the Pro 5 from WPPO. In order to get a really smoky taste in the chili, we're using mesquite wood in the pizza. Start by adding a couple of chunks of mesquite wood in the Pro 5. Then you want to add a Royal Oak Tumbleweed starter and let the loof slider do its thing. So while we're waiting for the pizza oven to get up to temperature with that beautiful mesquite flavor, it's time to start preparing the kangaroo. And we have about three pounds of ground kangaroo, and we want to start by browning the meat. Start by melting about two tablespoons of butter in a hot cast iron skillet, and then add the ground kangaroo meat. And when you start to get a beautiful brown color, you want to add about two tablespoons of our Big Sweet Barbecue Badass Beef food. Next, you want to add about 32 ounces of tomato sauce and about half a liter of beef broth. If you want to, you can also add half a beer. So the chili base is now done. The pizza oven is up to temperature. So it's time to add the first round of spices. And we're going to add four rounds. The first one has two tablespoons of onion powders, one tablespoon of paprika, one tablespoon of chicken bouillon, one tablespoon of beef bouillon, one tablespoon of chile New Mexico, and one tablespoon of chile arbol. When this is all mixed up, you wanna put the cast iron in the pizza oven, and then we're gonna cook this for about 45 minutes. So it's been about 45 minutes now, and it already smells amazing here in the backyard. So now it's time to add the second round of spices and a little bit of liquid. Start by removing the chili from the pizza oven. Then you want to add two tablespoons of ground cumin and a tablespoon of MSG garlic powder, chili New Mexico, and chili arbol. You also want to add beef broth, a little bit of water, a little bit of soy sauce, and a little bit of Worcestershire sauce. Then you want to stir thoroughly and put it back in the pizza oven for another 20 minutes. So it's been another 20 minutes and it's time to take out the chili again and put in the third round of seasoning. In this round, we're gonna put in one tablespoon of chili New Mexico and one tablespoon of chili arbol. And then we're gonna add two teaspoons of cumin, onion powder, and garlic powder. You also might wanna add some liquid to it. And then we're gonna put it back for another 10 minutes. So it's been about 10 minutes now, and it's time to remove the chili and add the fourth and the final spice round. In this round, you wanna add one tablespoon of the chili New Mexico, two teaspoons of cumin, and one teaspoon of garlic powder. And then it's time to put it back in the Pro 5 for another 10 minutes, and then the chili is ready. And that is how you make an awesome kangaroo chili on the Pro 5 from WPPO. And I think the only thing left to do is to try this chili and see what it tastes like. So here we go. Mm. Spicy, savory, jam-packed with flavors. This is really good. I hope you try this at home. Happy grilling.